front and that my potato isn't going to collapse in the deep fryer and just become full of oil and, and be unpleasant to eat. You know, when, when we deep frying something, what we want is the action of the oil on the outside of what we're deep frying. We don't want the oil to go inside it because the flavour of the oil is going to be unpleasant. Okay, so I've actually double crumbed those, just to be sure. And I can take this away now. Wash my hands after doing that. and then we've got our croquette potatoes ready to go into the deep fry. Now these freeze really well if you want and you can actually cook them from frozen. Again, you just reduce the temperature of that deep fryer a little bit. I'm going to pop those in the fridge for now. Check my cabbage. So my cabbage is grazing beautifully there now. I've got a really nice um, type of tan colour in there, it's not too dark which would suggest burning but it's not blonde so that it would uh, not have any nice caramelisation of those onions and stuff on there. So that's my cabbage and bacon, so it's nearly cooked now. So nearly all of that braising liquid, which in this case was the stock. And what we're going to do there now is I'm going to get clear down and then we're going to do the pork salt in box, which is the second part of this dish.